Mm -hmm. I'll have you go on the ground. Awesome. And for our demonstration, we'll go to the left leg, so just that they see. So we can use, if you have, this is an orb you can get on Amazon. It's a little bit bigger. It's more, it's, it's the same kind of hard. It's still hard as a lacrosse ball. Um, for a little bit more wider areas, I like to go with this. So the calf is a, a pretty big muscle. So we'll start with this one. So he's going to come underneath here. And now you're going to kind of lift your body up and you're just going to kind of come back and forth. Now this is your basic, you'll see a lot of people doing this, but what I like to do is I like to get the inside or the outside of the calf, kind of come mm. back and forth, and then I also like to go on the inside. So notice how he has to kind of maneuver and switch his body to get the inner calf. Mm -hmm. So right now he's flossing through some of that tissue, he's working side to side, gliding that fascia, increasing that blood flow of course, getting that brain to say, oh, wait a minute, I feel that. These are tight areas. I need to spend some time here. Perfect. Now, are you only going to hit the front side of the calf, or are you also get into that? We're going to also get into the front as well. So okay. now he hit the back, the sides, the inner part. We're going to go on your stomach. I'm going to go into the right leg now so you can see it. Exactly. Come a little bit closer to me so they can, they can see better. There you go, right there. Good. So right there, you're going to lay completely flat on the floor. And you're just going to roll forward and back. Exactly, side to side. And now come vertical and down. Yeah, down and up, down and up. Just all across that, that anterior tibialis. I know this is like the shin splint muscle. Mm -hmm. You know, if you're having some shin splints, um, definitely incorporating all of these, not just this one, but this is definitely help for that. Um, so this is this is part of what we call we we at ProMed Physical Therapy we simplify it into this acronym SMASH. Okay, SMASH. S starts for a sweat, a warm up. Maybe you start with a little heat. Maybe you do a little uh, you know maybe you do a little bike. Maybe you do some walking just to get a little bit warmed up. Then M is mobilize or myofascial release. And that's where we are right right now. Mm -hmm. So you think this is the end all be all? Definitely not. Right. So Definitely it's not just you do this and you you walk away. Right now, you know, we would have to activate the muscles. Definitely get into some strengthening. Right. Because mm -hmm. we need to get stronger. We can't just influence it and then leave it alone. You got to give it the tools to improve. Um, but that's not in this today. In this today, we're just talking about how to get the myofascial release going first.